physical system. The high performance geophysical system uses geoelectrical measurement to measure how much the soil resists or conducts electric current or ground resistivity. Wedges are planted in the ground in the search area and based on the soil's resistivity values. The device can detect the presence or absence of caves, cavities, tunnels, or hidden rooms. By pre-selecting in the system settings, the geophysical system will differentiate between metals such as gold, silver, and copper and even groundwater deposits. Device installation. One, plug the connector base into its port on the front of the main unit. Two, insert the two ends of the geophysical system cables into the sockets at the connector base. Three, connect the other end of the geophysical system's cables to the pliers. System Selection To begin, select Geophysical System from the main menu and press OK. After selecting the system, the Target Selection screen will appear. Target Type The type of target to be searched is selected from a list of targets that include Gold, Bronze, Silver, Water, Iron, Cavity, Copper. How to use. After selecting the target, the device generates an electric current through the two wedges to measure the search area's soil resistance. The measurements results are displayed. One, target is found. The results screen displays a 2D plot in the form of a set of color-changing ellipsoid curves, from green to red with a peak in the middle of the graph and corresponding to a certain value on the vertical axis corresponding to a percentage, representing the probability of the target presence in the area. To the right of the 2D plot are boxes containing information that includes the following. Target, which refers to the selected target type. Gold, for example, value is the ground resistivity measurement value. Rate is the percentage value of target presence probability. This ratio corresponds to the apex or peak of the upper ellipse on curves. Two, target not found. Here the curves or ellipses mentioned before will not be drawn and instead a message will be displayed indicating that the target was not found. In this case, the value related to soil resistance and the ratio value will be equal to zero. Note, ensure cables are properly connected to each wedge. If one of the wedges is not connected, a message will be displayed indicating that the target was not found. 